Welcome to Special Vids for Special Kids. Hello learners, it's Miss Hall here. And guess what? Let's explore. Conservation. The Earth provides resources that people and other living things use. An example of a natural resource is a forest. The trees, plants, and animals of the forest can be used for food, shelter, energy, and much more. The trees and plants help to clean the air, and the soil helps to clean rainwater. People and animals need clean air and water. The fungi, like mushrooms, and earthworms and bacteria that live in the forest break down dead trees and turn them into nutrients. Without them, there would be so many dead trees there wouldn't be room for living things. Conservation is when people take care of the Earth's resources. Resources can be renewable or non-renewable. The forest is a renewable resource. People can use some of the trees without harming the forest. New trees will grow in their place if the forest is healthy. However, taking too many trees can harm the forest and make it hard for new trees and plants to grow back. If too many trees are taken, it hurts many of the animals and fungi that need them. It takes away their food and homes. Without the trees, the soil can wash away when it rains, and so new trees have a harder time growing. Trees also help to cool the air, and without enough of them, the climate warms up. Other things people do, like using too much fossil fuel, also changes the climate. Fossil fuel is an example of a non-renewable resource. Fossil fuels are found underground. People use them as fuel for cars and buses and airplanes for electricity and to make things like plastic bottles and bags. So how can we be good stewards of the Earth's resources? Remember the three R's, reduce, reuse, and recycle. Reduce means thinking about how much of a resource do you really need and how can you use less of it so there will be more of it left. For example, if you can share a ride with a friend, by using one car instead of two, you are reducing the amount of gasoline that is used. If you turn off the light when you leave a room, you reduce how much electricity you use. Reuse means using fewer disposable items or using items again. Here is a landfill full of trash that people have thrown away. That's a lot of trash. Rather than throwing so many things away, can you find a new way to use them? And recycle. Many of the things we use like boxes and containers can be recycled. Plastic bottles and containers can be turned into new plastic items. Aluminum cans and other kinds of metal can be recycled, too. Glass jars and bottles can be recycled as well. If we all make good decisions to conserve our resources, it will make the Earth a healthier place for everyone. 